This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. All right, so we're talking about, well, not him. The game is too lazy. I mean, we'll talk a little bit. The game is just, I, I don't know. He's just too lazy to become a billionaire, bro. Like, you know, he he says, if I wanted to be a billionaire, I, I would have been one, man. I just, I'm chilling, you know? Like, I don't, I don't need billions, you know? Even though he has a tremendous amount of, dead on his hands with the cases against him but uh that's another story um look at drake looking at him like did you just say that my g are you crazy all right so um then we got <laughs> futures getting mail at magic city because on that 42 doug song you said magic city i'm the owner so he gets i guess he just gets mail at magic city now uh, that is hilarious, man. Like, people really take things literally, you know? <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I gotta say. Um, they say, future, come pick up your mail, Mr. Owner. Uh, then we got, uh, damn, you know, I gotta give uh, Moneybag Yo a salute, man, because, you know, he lost one of his baby moms. And um, he's stepping up, and, you know, he has to be a single father right now. I mean, that's just, that's horrible for his kid. He has to deal with that. It's just tough. He says, single parenting hard, especially when you're trying to pursue your dreams at the same time. Luckily, you know, I know it's hard to, you know, he has money so he can um, have some help. But, uh, you know, who do you trust with your children, you know? So, uh, you know, and... There's a lot of trauma there from the mom passing, you know, like for the kid, you know, like that's just how, how do you explain to a child that their mom's not there anymore, you know? So uh, to the same uh, time, women are the real definition of queens. We can't do this without y'all, but sometimes we're forced to. My situation I'm dealing with right now made me respect mothers even more. That's that's beautiful. All right, so then we got YNW Melly. Um, so one of the prosecutor, they're going to have like a detective or something. They, they really strongly believe he was the gunman. Um, an expert detective says uh, it all. Um, <laughs> to be honest with you, man, there's a lot of evidence in this case. I know that you, even if someone's a YNW Melly fan, that doesn't, you know, he makes music you like, but it doesn't mean he can just go around and, you know, do whatever. Something happened. We don't know what. But he says there was heavy allegations against... Wait, while there's heavy allegations against Melly, he remains confident. Of course, you got to remain confident you're going to go back home. You know? What else you got? You want to fight a case, right? But um, apparently there's strong evidence, court documents... A uh, detective will be called to stand eyewitness, an investigator who has claimed substantial amount of training and skill remaking shooting scenarios. Melly looked more like the shooter than his associate, 14. So we'll see what happens. I mean, he has a... <laughs> this case is crazy, man. Uh, he said it's it's not a hunt. Nothing's 100%. Wait, questions the officer about findings in this conclusion saying it's not 100% conclusive. Of course not. You know, so, you know, we'll see. I mean, you know, I'm sure this trial will be followed carefully as it goes to trial. DJ Khaled reacts to Kevin Hart, uh, you know, teasing him because, you know, DJ Khaled has that thing, you know, they didn't believe I could sell gold platinum. God did. You know, he does that for everything, you know. So then uh, Kevin Hart said uh, they didn't believe I could sell out another tour. God did. And then he keeps going, God did. <laughs> he says that. He said, it really breaks my heart. They really didn't believe in us. God did. God did. But then he got so much love from that that he spins it into Drake did because Drake saved him. <laughs> I don't care how you spin it, man. Drake really blessed him to take him to the next level with, you know, I know Cal was doing hits before and all that. Don't get me wrong. Drake took him to another level, though. And Drake always comes through for him. You know? Drake always comes through and saves him. You used to say Meek, Meek Mill, too. Didn't on the last album, though. But uh, there was one Meek Mill album, though, that just went because, remember, he broke up with Nicki? That was a good album, too. That was I think that was one of his best albums. Well, which one was that? 
you know which one I'm talking about. I don't have to, I don't know the name of each one. What was it dream? It wasn't. It was. Uh, I can't remember. Yeah, nightmare. I don't know. Everything's with a dream. It was like 2017 that came out, and then he went to jail. That was a great album, though. I love that album. And that's about it, man. I think we went through everything. That was fast. All right. Well, I appreciate you guys, and I hope you guys are having a great day. Uh, I've been sleeping a lot today, I'm going to be honest with you. I've been tired. Catching up. That's what the weekends are for, though, man. Catch up a little bit. Get right back to it. Appreciate you guys. I'll check you guys on the next one. Uh, let me see. I thought I missed something, but I don't think I did. All righty. You guys have a great day. I will check you back in like an hour or two. Uh, this is Jordan Tower with JT News.